My friend Lisa Niver has scuba dived all over the world, but never here in Puerto Rico. She's seen just about everything you can see underwater. And as you can imagine, it's pretty hard to impress her at this point. So I've asked her to take a dive here. Let's see what happens. I love to go scuba diving. It's one of my most favorite things, and I've actually had the chance to dive almost everywhere, six continents around the world. Yes. Well, I think Asheville has been known to be one of the best dive spots in the whole island. Pretty much, we do wall dives here. Typical dive, uh, at least in the fishes, you'll see a lot of yellowtail snappers, a lot of grunts, uh, yellow stripe and blue stripe, barracudas, blue heads, yellowtail wrasse, uh, angelfish, butterfly fish, French, uh, four eyed, you name it. I mean, if you're lucky, we'll see sea turtles. Yesterday, actually, we saw a pretty nice one. Animals underwater and all around will uh, react to you on what the vibe you give them. I mean, if they feel you're a dangerous person to them, I don't think they really get that close. If they pick up a good feeling off of you, they'll even get closer. I mean, I had so many great encounters underwater. Um, yesterday, even, um, the sea turtle we call Lola, we actually know it's her because she has four barnacles on the back of her shell. Uh, doing the perfect square. So we, we spot her pretty quick every time she comes. I mean, she knows me already from all the dives, and yesterday I wasn't even looking at her, and when I looked, she was already swimming towards me. You can't get any better than that, having nature respond to you being in their own atmosphere. <laughs> wow. That was cool. That was amazing. I never saw anything like that. That eel was just like, Whoa! Yeah. Come and dive at Copa Marina in Puerto Rico. It's the most amazing dive I've ever done on almost every continent. We saw everything. It was like an aquarium. 